I S U P K. Just like you. 
Thank you. Go ahead. Thou shalt any wise refuse thy neighbor. Go ahead. And not suffer sin unto him. It's, it's uh, telling you not to do all kind of wickedness to your brother. It's telling you that. It's telling you not to uh, sell crack to your brother. That's not right. to sell weed to your brother. If you love yourself, would you uh, kill yourself? If you ain't gonna do the things that you do to your brother to yourself, then why would you do that to him? Why would you give your, your brother uh, something that's gonna kill him? Why would you do that? Go ahead. Selfishness. Verse 18. Thou should not offend nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people. But thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. Read that one more time because I don't think they caught what, just, what he just read. It says that you shall love the children of thy people, not everybody else. Everybody else is not your neighbor, black man, Hispanic man, Native Indian man. That's right. Your neighbor is the people that's going through the same hell that you're going through. The people that uh, got woolly hair just like you. The man that's standing in the hood just like you. That's right. Go ahead. Read that one more time. Oh, God. Thou should not avenge nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people. So your brother is the same person that came out the nation. If you a Negro, your brother is uh, black, Hispanic, and Native Indian. That's, That's right. It. Nobody else. The white man is not your brother. Stop listening to that Christian pastor that you love so much. Because in the Christian church, they'll tell you that love your brother, meaning love everybody in the whole world. And that's not in the scriptures. Go ahead and read that one more time. Verse 18. Thou shalt not avenge nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people. So when, when your brother does something to you, don't bear it against him. Forgive that brother. Because he's going through the same hell that you're going through. He trying to eat every day just like you. He trying to survive this hell and this oppression just like you. That's right. So forget that man. Try to understand why is he doing this. Try to fix that black man. Forgive him. Go ahead. But thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. I am the Lord. The Lord commanded you to love blacks, Hispanic, and Native Indians. That's it, black man. Go ahead and grab. Uh, Matthew 18 and 21. So, the Lord told you, don't hate your brother over the small, small, smallest things. Forgive your brother. If uh, your brother offended you in some kind of way, forgive him and show him the right way. That's what a real man does. Love your brother like yourself. Right. If you ain't gonna smoke crack, don't give it to your your brother to smoke crack. Right. That's backwards, man. You're supposed to love your brother. But the white man, he the, the way you can tell he's not your brother is because he does all kind of wickedness to you. He is the one that supplying the hood with drugs. He is the one that supplying the hood with guns. Black people don't don't own no gun shops. Black people don't manufacture guns. Come on, man. Get real. Where are these guns coming from in our neighborhood? Go ahead, Matthew. Chapter 18. Verse 21. Then Peter came to him and said, Lord, how oft shall my brother sit against me? And I forgive him. So, till seven times. So what Paul is asking him is, how many times should I forgive this brother for offending me? How many times should I forgive him? 
He's done me wrong so many times. How many times should I forget this man? Go ahead. Matthew 18, verse 21. Then came Peter to him and said, Lord, how often shall my brother sin against me? So how many times shall he sin against me and I forgive him? That's what Paul is asking Christ. Yahweh shot in the Hebrew, which is a black man. Go ahead. And I forgive him till seven times. 22. Jesus said unto him, I say not unto thee until seven times, but until seventy times seven. So Christ told him, forgive that man, no matter, in a nutshell, he's saying, forgive that man no matter how many times he offends you. No matter how many times he steal from you. You supposed to forgive that brother. You supposed to go to your brother and let him know what he did is wrong. That's what you're supposed that's brotherhood, man. That's right. That's how you love your neighbor like yourself. Is that it on that barbecue show? Come, come. Grab for me uh first John 4. So you're supposed to like you're supposed to love your brother as many times as it takes for him to correct himself and change. That's how many times you forgive your brother. But if you, if you don't have that in you, come to the ISUBK and get counseling on that. We do that. We counsel brothers 24/7 on power on uh, on different kind of things that they go through. So many times. So many times. It's uh, First John 4 and 21. Never forgive. We supposed to forgive our brother, love our brother, man. Yeah. We, I hate oh, keeping this snake, man. Right. First John, chapter four. First, there it go again. You supposed to love your brother, man. Stop offending your brother. Stop trying to fight your brother over every little thing. When you got a problem, like I said, go to that brother or go to the like. The men in the ISUBK, we'll sort that out for you. That's right. We, our phones is open 24-7 for the problems of our people. We ain't trying to, we trying to get our people right. Go ahead. Go to John 5 and 12. No matter how many times your brother does things against you, you forgive that brother. That's how you show love to your brother. If you if you could, this this is the ultimate love you can show your brother. You die for that man. That's right. You give up everything for that man. You do everything in your power to show that man the right way. That's love for your brother. Your brother is the Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians only. I don't know how much I can stress that. Go ahead. John 5 and 2. No. No. Yeah. John and John or John 15 and 2. The white man is murdering you non-stop, sending drugs to your neighborhood, give you uh pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster, serving it on a platter. He putting uh, poison in your food, in your water, and you won't sit here and tell me that's your brother? Why he murdering you in the street? Why he tasing, tasing you, beating you, hanging you? And you still trying to love this man? You still listening to the Christian church, the Christian pastor, telling you to love everybody when everybody's offending you? When everybody's doing you wrong, come on, man, get real. Go ahead. John, chapter 15, verse 12. Go ahead. This is my commandment, that ye love one another. So this is the conclusion of the whole matter, man. At the end of the day, love your brother like you love yourself, man. Don't do nothing to 
your brother that you wouldn't do to yourself. And with, and with, that's my last scripture, but I wanted to say, Shalom, Yahweh, Shamar, Alatan, Bashim, Yahweh, Shah, to all my sisters. Shalom, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh, Shah, Rakatah, to all my brothers. And we all go 125th, 1 West, Harlem, New York, under command of General Yohanna, of the ISUPK. Shalom. Trying to find something to follow Had loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed, so packed I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick, a habit that's hereditary from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good ship Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No calling can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword. With